Beautiful, hot South Florida day here in Pompano Beach. Uh, welcome. We're going to make a really lovely and easy uh, dinner. It's going to be pan seared fish, a little bit of kale salad, rose honey peas in the house. Come here, let's say hi. You want to chop? Uh, get your took us up here. Uh, that's what's going on. I hope you're having a lovely Sunday. We just got back from the store. We had a nice family trip to the store. And uh, Rosie had a little shopping car. She got a ton of stuff. Uh, this morning, I made, uh, you want to chop something? I made some chicken liver mousse, which Jesse wants a little appetizer of right now. And uh, that's it. The girls took a nap. I was working on the app, hanging out, having a good time. Yeah, whatever you need, Rosie. And now we're going to make beautiful kale crunch salad with a nice vinaigrette. And then I got some of Desi's favorite fish. What is it? What is it, Rose? What's mommy's favorite fish? Leave a comment down below. Uh, please leave a comment down below. Let us know where you're watching from. Oh, oh, you found a special maple syrup with strawberries in there, huh? Yeah. Just a little bit. Show me a little bit. A little bit, right? A little bit. A little bit. Uh, let us know where you're watching from. I want to see people from all around the world. Uh, just like pretty much every other live stream that I can get bottles open on is sponsored by Thrive Market. I brought out even more of my favorite Thrive Market favorites here. Um, I will go through them specifically like the best non-toxic dishwashing pods. Just a little bit, Rose. Uh, the best sweet potato chips cooked in coconut oil. Shout out to a Flav City family, uh, family member for telling me about that. Um, the link in the description box. Let me just make sure I get it right. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live. That's right. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live gets you 25% off your first order. No more, Rosie. 25% off your first order. A free gift up to $40 now, I believe, which is amazing. And no more, Rosie. No more. No more. Rosie, <laughs> no more. Dunzo. And that's 30 days risk free. I put all of my favorite Thrive Market favorites in. No more, Rosie. No more. No more. We're going to do. We got to chop in the description box. Okay. Desi! Mommy, I need some help here. Uh, let's get going. I want to... Rose, you can't drink any more maple syrup. No more, more, more. No more, more. Let's get going on the fish. Here. Let's get you and Mommy a microphone. Here, you and Mommy. You guys can ask Rosie and Desi anything. They'll have their own microphone here. This should be the way live streams are. Mom and Rosie are just chilling there. Here, Mama. Here. Rosie, you got to peel a... Uh, a little bit. Oh, let me turn the thing on over there. Here's the comments for you, mother. All right. Hashtag Ask Desi. Burning questions. Hashtag Ask Rosie. Right? I can get some easy questions out of the way right now. Where's Brad? Brad had to move back to Chicago. He had some family issues. So we lost uh, Brad. Uh, what else is burning question? Is the app available? Yes, it is. It's been a soft launch, so we're not advertising it. But if you go to yeah, the Google yeah, Play Store or the Apple App Store, Bobby Approved. I have to read the Search comments. Bobby Approved. It'll be on there. No, no, the app is going no, very, very well. No, 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 if you spot any no, mistakes no, no, in the app, just email support no, at flavecity.com. No, okay, I have Desi's favorite fish. I'm sure somebody guessed and said Arctic char. It's easy to get it at Whole Foods. Such a lovely fish. It's like a cross between salmon and whitefish. It's nice and fatty. It's hard to overcook. And I'm going to. The microphone is a little too uh, static or something? Mine or is. Bobby's or, or mine? Lower the mic there, sir. Lower the mic there, sir. Test, test, test. I'm talking right now. <laughs> Maybe mine. What do you guys? Is it my oh, Bobby's my, there? Sir. I'm probably talking too loud. I'll just, I gotta get a new microphone. I, I don't know what's going on. Like, for some reason, it's on live streams. It's super hot always. I don't know. Sit in mommy's lap, Rosie. If there's one thing you can count on with a Flame City live stream, Could it's audio mean? issues. Yeah, we're not touching the iPad, right? Daddy needs that. Audio issues. Daddy needs this, Rosie. Here. Who wants a drink? What can you get to drink? Hey, with? a lemonade. Ooh, who wants a lemonade? Who wants Daddy's lemonade? Hey, and who wants a snack? Ooh. Let's make a oh, little... Oh, um... who wants to make a little chicken liver keto toast? Mm. Uh, Rosalind? I'm going to preheat the panther. 
That's okay. I'll put, put one in the toast. No, no. Put it here. It's better. Okay. It's better. Oh, Rose is coming. Careful. The, the most amazing new bread is from Base Culture. It's keto sourdough. Oh, it's my favorite. Bread. It is phenomicity. Yeah, probably their best bread so far. It's so good. It's keto, gluten free. It doesn't have a weird flavor and it's just yummy. Mm hmm. It's super yumtastic. Okay, so this is the Arctic char. Don't touch Rose, please. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to season it with a little bit of seafood rub. What's a good spice rub? Give me some inspiration, you guys. What's a nice spice rub to complement the fish without overpowering it? Oh, huh, sweetie? Let's see. Okay, Rose is craving to be the moderator here. Yeah, the fish is Arctic char. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. McCormick salmon seasoning. I don't have any seasoning like that. Herbs, I see. You know what's really nice with that? Fennel. Fennel powder. Very Mediterranean, right? Mm-hmm. How about that? Uncle Rose is taking pictures of the salmon. Uh, fennel powder is lovely. You could pull up the uh, comments on your phone if you want to see it. Oh, okay, sure. Uh, what else? A little bit of... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nothing too powerful. Turmeric. I just love using turmeric, especially for the color. And a little bit of coriander. And how about my Greek oregano that I got in Athens. Where's that stuff? Where'd you put that stuff, Babel? Do you know? It's down there. It's in here? Oh, here. We uh, Marie Kondoed the... Down here? Mm -hmm. No. Down here. All the way down. Oh, here we go. We organized the uh, laundry room. We got one of those. Like, multi. Saint Cumin. Cumin? Um, I skipped cumin today. A little bit of olive oil. Dill, dill and butter. Oh yeah, that sounds good That's actually. That's nice. Let me see if I have Herb, dill. Herb, garlic. Touch of oregano. Dill we'll is it perfect. Greek style. Oh man, this Greek dill. oregano is money. Let me see if I have dill weed. Dill Lemon and garlic. That sounds good, guys. Lemon garlic? Yeah, here. Garlic powder. Sounds nice. We should have dill weed, no? Dill weed. Mm. What is the best place to order pasture-raised chicken? Cook's Venture. They actually sell to Thrive Market too, but you can't get uh, like a whole box anymore. Um, I'll have a promo code at some point in the near future. Wait for it. Cook's Venture has the best, not just pasture-raised chicken, it's heirloom slow grown pasture raised chicken it's unbelievable so this is what i'm talking about this is the new bread i'll have a promo code at some point this month sourdough keto based culture bread a florida owned company whenever you want to toast these kinds of breads i would recommend not doing it in a um <clears throat> in a toaster I'd recommend doing it in a pan griddled with a little bit of butter or ghee. It just gets more moist and crispy as opposed to getting dry and craggly. $10 from Cassie Davis. Oh, Cassie. Nice to see you. She's always so... Finishing my layered order. Mm, nice. Family and vacay are fun, but it's nice to sleep in your own bed. That's right. <laughs> oh, it's so nice. Are you kidding me? And Need a little thing for mine. And Jackie Spiegel. Hi, Bobby and Desi, sweet Rose. Bobby, you need another helper. When will the frozen dinners come out? I do need another helper really bad. Um, so we're working on, they're not frozen, they're Flav City prepared meals. We're pitching them to Costco, but after Costco, we're gonna pitch them to other grocery stores nationwide. So think about Flav City chicken fried rice with best in class ingredients. Flav City Keto Turkey Meatballs with Keto Mash and Keto Dipping Sauce. Mac and Cheese, Cauliflower Cheese, all my favorite dishes, but available pre-cooked. All you have to do is heat and serve. We are probably going to be pitching Costco, I'm guessing, later this month or maybe in August. And then we'll go for other grocery stores. 
Everybody's asking when Dirk is visiting. Why don't you guys ask him? Uh, he's always welcome. Dirk is and, always welcome. And uh, he can come anytime he wants. We have a revolving door. You come here, you get an organic birch mattress to sleep on. I have extra uh, towel clean toothbrushes, right? Yeah, we got the best beds and the best toothbrushes. All we ask for is a really good review. I don't think you can find that in a hotel. We just want a good review on Yelp. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> right? No, TripAdvisor. I'm sorry, TripAdvisor. And right. also Art, he, he might be coming to visit at some point. Yeah. We don't know when. Art's busy because he started a new job and he can't take too much time off right now. But yeah. He, I, I told him to come for a weekend. You know? Yeah, for sure. I know the Eggman wants to come for a weekend, maybe. He said he's first he's going to visit his dad and then he's going to... Oh, yeah, he wants to visit his dad in uh, Arizona first. <clears throat> yeah, Dirk is the best. He's like 10, ste 10 steps ahead of you. So helpful. Dirk is awesome. He's the best. Great house guest, too. Yeah. Good cleaning skills. I always look for that in a house guest, their cleaning skills. <laughs> okay, so the fish is marinated just to help that marinade absorb the in. The Flav City app is out, you guys. It's a soft launch. Uh, still working on approving our products, but you can download it on the App Store or Google Play. By searching Bobby Approved. Yeah. Yeah. It's going well. Obviously, there's a little hiccups in the beginning. That's why we're doing a soft launch. Yeah, always take a photo if you're prompted to take a photo for a product. Or uh, email support at flavecity.com if you see any issues or if you see any products that are uh, oh, careful. If you careful. are if they are Bobby approved, but I shouldn't, or vice versa, just email us at support at Flave City, as we're, we're still working through thousands and thousands of products. Um, so yeah, if you see any issues, just email us. Um, but other than that, yeah, it's uh, it's going great, uh, and a lot of people we're hearing from a lot of people that they love it. Yeah, the reviews are very, very positive, so it's pretty cool. Okay, guys, welcome. We're cooking fish with my girl, Desi, my girl, Rose. Uh, Thrive Market is the sponsor. Let me just show you what's going on right here. So in the first line of the description box on mobile, you have to click the arrow right there. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live. It gets you 25% off your first order and a free gift up to $40. But I put all my favorite Thrive Mama. Market uh, stuff Mama. here. Not just food, Mama. but Mama. Mama. this Mama. stuff. Mama. Vitamins, Mama. shampoo, Mama. dishwashing tabs, and here's the deal. It's 30 days risk-free. So if you don't love Thrive Market the way we do, cancel. Get your membership fee back. But their dishwashing packs are one of the most non-toxic. And if you don't know about household cleansers like uh, laundry soap and dish soap, highly toxic. They can have endocrine move? disruptors, okay. which are really bad. These are fantastic, and the price is right. Thrive Market Ghee is the way to go. Our Thrive Market uh, Collagen Peptides and the Ghee is the way to the go. They're keto the coconut flakes. Go. Search um, coconut cereal on the Thrive Market on the app or desktop. This cereal is amazing. All this stuff is fantastic. It's cheaper than the grocery store, and my promo code gets you 25% off your first order. Thrive Market is a six-year supporter of the channel, so at least try them out. It's 30 days risk-free. Okay. Why am I wearing big clothes? Because that's my style. I'm a, I'm a boho style. Boho chic, right? Boho style. It feels comfortable, you guys. Why do I have to wear tight clothes? Is that the thing? Didn't yeah. know that was a thing to wear tight clothes. I used to wear you tight clothes chips? when I was 20 years old. Now I'm 40 and I wear big clothes because I feel comfy. Big girls, you are beautiful. There you go. Check out Why these do chips. people associate big clothes or boho clothes with being pregnant? I mean, don't assume something. Oh, no, not me. Oh, my God. Mm. Thank you, guys. That's the style. I know. All right. This? I Thank made this you guys. morning. You're so sweet. This is chicken liver mousse. It's pasture-raised chicken livers with a little bit of red onion, a lot of butter, a little bit of coconut milk blended together with salt. I'm going to smear that onto Ooh. the keto toast because, ladies, just in case you know, if you are having that time of the month, but in general, if you want iron in your diet, which is very hard to get through Thank food, you. Moose or chicken liver, beef liver is amazing at that. Chicken liver compared to chicken breast, chicken thighs, chicken wings, a million times more nutrient dense. The vitamins and minerals 
and good fats in there is off the chart. You want coconut? You want uh, almond milk too? Um, Do you want some? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. You got it, kiddo. Uh, That's the Thrive Market almond milk. Uh, yeah. There's two almond milks I like. Uh, Thrive Market and this. This is Elmhurst, an amazing nut company. But when you buy almond milk, it's almost all. Do you want some? It's, I'm going to open this one. It's even creamier. When you buy almond milk, it's almost all water and emulsifiers. There's about five almonds per cup. Look, at, look how creamy this one is, Rose. Look at this. Look at that. This one has four times more almonds because there's no oils. There's no emulsifiers. Same thing with uh, the Thrive one. I find the Elmhurst a little creamier. Isn't that good, Rose? This is it, right here. You want me to open that one too? Wow. She wants to do a side by side here. Side by side. All day, it's catering to Rose. Oh, she wants that over the Thrive Market one, actually. See, that actually tastes like almonds to me. So does the Thrive Market one. This has one emulsifier, this has zero. But most of the store are just emulsifiers and water. Which one has zero? Elmhurst. Oh, oh, oh. Rose, 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 Rose. Whoopsie. There you go. Not a big deal. Okay. Now come up here. Okay, appetizer, toast points, and chicken liver mousse, y'all. Okay, welcome, y'all. Please leave comments down below. Let us know where you're watching from. Let us know what you're making for dinner. Hashtag ask Desi. Hashtag ask Rose. We are making my favorite fish, Arctic char. We're doing a lovely Mediterranean marinade. We're going to pan sear it. I'm going to make a lovely kale salad with a creamy tangy dressing. That's it. Thank you guys. Very nice comments. Everybody's saying I look great. I agree. They love my style. Hadi patati Thank you. House. Thank you. Thank you so much. Very sweet of you guys. Hadi patatimus. Okay. See yeah, organ meats are great, you guys. Look at that, see? The name of the app is Bobby Approved. You can search for Bobby Approved. You can search for Flav City. Um, it's going to come up. We'll do a little demo of the app. So yeah. The gist of the app is like having me shopping with you. The cool thing is, anywhere in the U.S. or Canada, A, you can scan any barcode, and it will tell you if the product is Bobby Approved or not. And if it's not Bobby Approved, it'll give, give you better recommendations. Now, it's a lot easier than said to do this because in the grocery stores, there's probably just shy of a million products, right? So we had to go through not all of them, but tens of thousands the of them that fall in that gray area. Of like could be bad, could be good because we developed an algorithm that automatically said no to anything that had canola oil, refined sugar, uh, natural flavor, stuff like that. But there's so many things that are in between the box up here. and they won't auto approve anything. I have to do that manually. So we've gone through probably 30,000 so far. Yes, we have more to go. Here you go, sweetie. Up, Rose, let's have a little snack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I have to know there are some like keto diabetic yeah. products, I tell you, yeah, where yeah. Mm. it has natural flavors, but it's still Bobby approved like a Zebia soda. Well, it's good because I'd rather you have wow, it's really good. natural flavors and 30 grams of sugar. So I got to go in and manually mm. fix all that. This is so good, right? Oh my God. Yeah. Yummy. Jackie made the Bulgarian yogurt soup and it's the bomb. Mmm. She's half Turkish. She ja remembers her grandmother making it. Jackie, yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, Bulgarian. Obviously. Jackie, I thought you were Jewish. She is, I think. You could be Turkish and Jewish. Right? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Rose, you're out of control. <laughs> Obviously, the Bulgarian cuisine is very influenced by Turkey because of the Ottoman Empire. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's start working on the salad here. I see mm -hmm. $5 from Olena. Hi, Bobby. What is the best mosquito repellent spray you would recommend? Um, right here, actually. Blue one, we have Buzz Aloe. <laughs> Buzz Aloe is good. Also, California Baby, baby or no? Yeah. California Baby and yeah. Buzz Aloe. I mean, honestly, if there's too many mosquitoes, nothing can save you. Yeah, like yeah. in the backyard here, we have oh, so forget many. forget about it. I go, I go out. Even though I spray myself, I get beaten like crazy. Brutal. And this is one of the best, most accessible 
shampoo and conditioners. It's called a Cure. It's $3 cheaper on Thrive Market than Whole Foods. I get the shampoo and the conditioner. This one's nice here, the one with, uh, what is this, the argon one? Yeah, argon and pumpkin seed. So when you use my promo link down below, thrivemarket.com slash bobbylive, get the shampoo and conditioner, but the conditioner's been sold out now for two and a half months. I talked about it too much. Yes, we are keto slash paleo. We're not uh, either, uh, we're not 100% keto. Nope. We like fruits and other things, but we, we stick to the paleo diet. Here and there, we might have some legumes and rice. For sure. Maybe some pasta made of chickpeas. Once a week, maybe. But. For the most part, we um, try to be paleo. Mm hmm. And low carb. But if you're trying to lose serious weight, if you're diabetic or pre-diabetic, in my opinion, the keto diet is the answer to that. It will shed the weight. It will get your numbers down in a hurry. And then once you have things under good control, then you can start introducing some paleo fruit like mangoes, bananas. Uh, you can have sweet potatoes and stuff like that. But super important to, uh, to do a keto diet first. Also, if you have... Um, cancer or you're recovering from cancer babe what do cancer cells feed off of you want to do this rose sugar sugar and guess what sugar is not just sugar like cane sugar and stuff sugar in the form of starch and carbs grains. and grains and gluten that gets converted to sugar in your body which is why the keto diet i say oh, is the cancer killer because the cancer cells can't survive without that sugar Mm -hmm. More, more, more. Ma, 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 more. More. Ready? Pull. Pull, 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 pull. This is the kale stripper. I love this thing. Da. Da. Ready? Pull over here. Pull. Pull. Pull, 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 pull. Brava, Malorna. <clears throat> and then paleo allows you to eat sweeteners like maple syrup, coconut sugar. Keto, you can only have sugar alcohols or allulose or zero glycemic. Rosie, pull. Sweeteners. We, we've never been overweight, but Bobby was chubby when I he was I was chubby, there. like when I was 14, 15, but I didn't even know it. That's the but beauty But that's like before you like, you kind of grew, grew up. Yeah. I didn't even know it back then. I started working out when I was 16 and I got jacked and a couple of people were like, wow, dude, your jack used to be chubby. And I was like, I was? So I, it's probably good I didn't know that. <laughs> in the eyes of your mom, you were perfect. I'm well, sure. my mom, may she rest in peace, would take me for lunch at middle school and let me get two double chili cheese dogs. Two double? I'm pretty sure. Maybe it was one. A double chili cheese dog from White Hen. Oh. And when I went to get a checkup, my cholesterol was sky high. At, and the doctor's at 15 like, years old? Yeah, 15 or whatever. <laughs> And like years later, when I was really into fitness, I'm like, Mom, why'd you let me do that? And she's like, I didn't know you liked it and yada, yada. I'm like, okay, what are you going to do? All right. So and the moral of the story is don't eat double chili cheese dogs every day during the week. What if you're type 1 diabetes? Um, you follow the same uh, diet as a type 2. It's the same thing. Type 1's a tough uh, hand to be dealt. It sucks. Because you're born with it? Yeah. Lady Gaga, you're born that way. I'm reading the comments, Rose. I'm reading the comments. Mama's a moderator. So I got kale. That means yes in Bulgarian. <laughs> kale has to be organic, in my opinion. It's on the dirty dozen. Dirty, dirty, Rose. Exactly. Uh, Tuesday, I'm going to Houston with Erica. We're having a meeting to uh, do the final planning for the Flav City cookware set with Tramantina. They're going to be our partner. They're an amazing Brazilian cookware company. And sometime early next year, we'll have the Flav City cookware set. Um, follow at Flav City on Instagram. I'll give you a ton of behind the scenes, uh, what the name of the cookware set is, which is really, really good, and um, what it's going to encompass. It's a very unique cookware set that no one's really seen before. More, more milk? All right, yeah. keep leaving comments down below. Uh, we don't compost here, but we'll be composting at the new house we're building in Boca. If you're looking for the app, 
Uh, if you have an Android, go to Google Play and search Bobby Approved. Yeah. If you have an iPhone, go to App Store and search Bobby Approved. It's going to pop right up. Are those the only two operating systems around? That's it. There's Android no and There's iOS? That's else. it? No one has a third party one? No. <laughs> Do I ever make a salad with lettuce? Um, I love kale. Kale is actually one of the most nutrient dense vegetables around. It's not just popular in a hipster food, it's really, really good for you. Whereas something like romaine, kind of a lightweight. Lady Gaga. I, I get Rose's dresses from Gap, but also I get a lot of gifts uh, from friends and family. So. Uh, yeah, but not most of them and the one she's currently wearing is from Gap. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, Chugging that Flav City almond milk like a boss lady, huh? Right? Oh, yeah. Kathy and Newbaum, uh, 99 cents. Thanks, Kath. Look at a smiley face. Appreciate that. Um, so, talking about the diets, we have two cookbooks that will really help you eat clean. The first one, uh, is from two years ago. It's keto meal prep. If you're keto, she's opening the thing again, man. If you're keto or diabetic, <laughs> keto you meal prep is what you want. There's 125 well, hold plus hold low carb keto recipes that are super, super tasty. Because when you're on keto, it can get a little tough to be creative. This book, though, is came out December 1st. It's still a number one bestseller. It's Flav City's Five Ingredient Meals. Why I love this book the most is that. Don't it's five it. ingredient healthy meals anybody can make. There's sweet and savory in here, but the kicker, there's no cookbook in my opinion on the market like this because I uh, took all my shopping knowledge and I put it in this book. So for every recipe and every chapter, I tell you exactly what to buy at the grocery store and I tell you why. So even if you can't find that product, I tell you look for ones that avoid and that don't have like canola oil or whatever. So I literally tell you in this cookbook, for every recipe, exactly what to buy. So you're making spaghetti carbonara, buy this kind of pasta and why. Buy these kind of eggs and why. Making chick fried rice, buy this kind of seasoning sauce. Making beef chili with five ingredients, use a simmer sauce that has best in class ingredients like that. Making breakfast, like, bum, bum, bum. here we go. Low carb crepes Benedict, get low carb wraps or tortillas like that. So go on Amazon if you're interested. Search five ingredient meals, Flav City, five ingredient meals. You will love this book. If you have bought it, I ask you one favor, please leave an Amazon review. Those are actually really, really important for search rankings. Felicia, $5. How you guys love watching, use the app for the first time and love it. This you always look great and comfortable. Love the style, loose clothes rock. Thank you. Thanks, Felicia. Yeah. I'm using my right hand, it's still not working. You, do? you do it, Rose. Yeah. Da. You're better than me, Rose. Wow. Where are your pots going to be manufactured? Say again? Where are your pots and pans going to be manufactured? Oh, um, so the majority of it's going to be from Brazil. Uh, unfortunately, there is a couple of things you kids cannot avoid with China. Um, but the majority of it is in Brazil. Oh, over there, Mom. Rose, you're supposed there? to do it over there. You're doing a good job. Yeah. Yeah, peel it over I'm here. trying to avoid China as much so as possible, but for see. certain things, it's everybody very, very hard to do. But it's still very high quality. Oh, Tramontina is a around, very please. good brand. Turn around, please. But what's unique about the cookware set is that, without spoiling it, I'm not going to make you commit to all one type of finish are all one type of pot and pan. Like you're not gonna get all nonstick or all stainless steel. It's a really, really unique. Where did my carrot go, Rose? Oh, here, thanks. It's, it's gonna be something where every home cook will need it and you're gonna use every piece because the reason why it came to me, the idea, is so many people ask me what cookware to get and you end up buying a 14 piece set, half of which you never use. This one you will use every single piece and it will be essential to your cooking. Uh, Loon is saying $5. Hi, Bobby. I have sarcoidosis. It's an autoimmune disease, mostly affecting lungs. What foods or diet would recommend for this? 
affecting the lungs. Hmm. I'd have to look into that, but I'd say for autoimmune, an anti-inflammatory diet is a must. Always, always. So inflammatory foods are ones that have canola oil and other processed seed oils, refined sugars, um, gluten. So go on YouTube, search Flav City infla inflammatory foods or anti-inflammatory foods. I'd start there. So another super chat from Patricia found the book at Barnes and Noble. Nice. And Carstel 1399 Canadian. You've inspired me to eat better. And I lost 20 pounds. Thank nice. You're getting me from Toronto. Love it, Toronto. One day. I can't wait to go to Toronto. Check out the food scene. Not now, because I'm not going to quarantine for 14 days. That's for sure, but one day. Come? Okay, I'm coming. I've heard very good things about Toronto. Oh, gosh. Or there's peels of carrots everywhere. There we go. Done. Okay, so I'm making the salad right now. The Arctic char is marinating. Once again, get Arctic char at Whole Foods. It's a lovely fish. Everyone who's tried it adores it. I have some sugar snap peas left over from uh, stir fry the other day. I'm gonna add those too, I love it. Sugar snap peas. How many times have I snacked on them during a live stream? Must be very annoying to hear it. Mm-hmm. Rose, careful, Mishka. Careful, Mishka. Mm-hmm. Mint. Yeah, this is the mint. The mint spray, yeah. Yeah. Mint, mint, mint. Hmm. Really tasty. Released a really cool video yesterday about the July Costco sale. Today I did some Aldi finds. Um, I have a video coming out probably Tuesday about buying meat and seafood at Sam's Club. And then another video about the top five yes. new and exciting things at um, Costco that I didn't talk about in the video yesterday. Yes, carrots have sugar, but it's a complex carbohydrate. It's not like eating cane sugar. Exactly. So, yes. But Keto? No. Mm -hmm. Paleo? Yes. See mm -hmm. why we do a mix? I'm not interested in going into ketosis. <laughs> I don't need to lose weight or get my numbers down. Careful, careful. I like carrots. I like sugar snap careful peas. If you want to make a keto, you wouldn't put the carrots in and you would put snow peas in instead of sugar snap peas because these have more natural sugar. Uh, stink ball. I'm 17, just started healthy keto. Do you know how much fat I should be eating a day? Yeah, very cool that you're doing a keto. Very cool that you're learning about that at a young age. It's not about the quantity of fat. It's about the quality. Stay away from the dirty oils like palm oil, canola, sunflower, safflower, peanut oil, soybean oil. Only eat grass-fed ghee, extra virgin olive oil, avocado oil, and virgin coconut oil. I would do a moderate fat keto diet with an emphasis on low carb. That's how you win, my friend. I don't believe in keto fat bombs and a high fat diet. And I cringe when I see people selling products that have palm oil and other garbage in there. You want to grate something? You want to grate something? Yeah, great. Okay. Dara, four ninety nine. You guys explain things in an easy to understand and follow way. Thanks so much. My eating habits have improved greatly. Love it. So, I'm. I'm dumb. I need things explained to me very, very simply. So I like to explain things to other people in a very simplistic manner. Think of me like a caveman. I'm Phil Hartman, the unfrozen caveman lawyer from SNL back in the day. I need things explained to me very simply. And I figure maybe you're not as dumb as me, but why not explain it in a layman's term? Because I'm just a caveman. All right? Anyone remember that skit back in the day? Okay, Kathy, my mom is trying to make some changes. The best oil for baking. Okay, Rose, that's enough, Mom. Uh, the best oil for baking. Yes. Uh, or cooking. Okay, so if you want a one-to-one -one substitution, 
for baking, you can do avocado Mama, oil. Uh, olive no, oil. I think mean, avocado oil is better for that. For yeah, baking. I said avocado oil. Oh, avocado, yeah. Or you can do olive oil for certain recipes. Uh, coconut oil as well. Or uh, ghee. I also love using ghee. It makes things very moist. Yep. If a recipe calls for canola oil, just use avocado oil. It's that simple. <laughs> Bless you. The number one thing people can do is stop using processed oils. Let me tell you why. Using Here. oils like the stuff we grew up on, canola oil, sunflower, safflower, even if they're organic or expelled or pressed, Girl, come over here. these are highly processed yes. oils that are inflammatory and they're loaded with free radicals because they're processed to death, okay? Free radicals destroy the cells in your body. It also is inflammatory. Inflammation can lead to higher um, blood pressure. It can lead to heart disease, stuff like that. I laugh when the government or dietitians or the USDA says canola oil is heart healthy and something like virgin coconut oil is not. These are not heart healthy. They're the opposite. They cause higher cholesterol. They cause heart disease. Oh, okay. You've oh. got to swap those out for the oils we just talked about. There is nothing healthy about canola oil. It's really, really bad and bad for you and it's cheap as can be. That's why at the grocery store, it's in everything. Why do you think palm oil, palm fruit oil, canola oils and everything? It's cheap as hell, you guys. And it increases the, uh, the inflammation in your body and that's what leads to higher cholesterol. Cholesterol is not from fat. Cholesterol is from inflammation in your body and when you eat an inflammatory diet of canola oil and sugars and stuff like that, you're going to have constant inflammation and a high cholesterol. It's as simple as that. Go on Amazon and watch a really cool documentary by Dr. Mark Hyman called Fat Fiction. That's uh, same question about the carrots, peel or no peel. It, it's totally up to you. I don't uh, peel normally. Just, just as long as you wash them. I just fine. wash. Fine. I'm not a peeler. Desi's a peeler. I'm not a peeler. I do it for you, Josh. Uh, how do you like, uh, Shannon Phillips, $5. How do you like the lettuce grow farm stand? Do you still order from Shepherd's Meats? Lettuce grows okay. I liked it. If you're an urban person, you don't have room, sure. A little expensive, but it was okay. Um, Shepherd Meat, great company, started by a Flav City fan. I order from Bel Campo now. I like Bel Campo a little more. I have a great promo code for 20% off with Bel Campo. I know they had that mild controversy, but it really was nothing. I much prefer Bel Campo. Okay, kale, sugar snap peas, red bell peppers, and cucumbers in here. Always season your salads with a little pinch of salt and pepper. Why? Well, even though the dressing is gonna be seasoned, Dill. the Dill vegetables are bland yeah, as can be. You gotta season, season, season like at every step of the process. Yeah. That's how your food tastes yummy. I'm gonna start preheating the Flav City prototype pan. So, hint, in my cookware set, which has an amazing name, I can't tell you yet, you're gonna get one nonstick pan and one nonstick pan only. And it's gonna be made of very high quality ceramic. Teflon pans are poisonous. They're made with forever chemicals that if you scratch them or overheat them, they get released into your food. And once they go in your body, they're called forever chemicals. They never leave. You only want ceramic. Sure, it doesn't uh, perform quite as well as uh, Teflon. Who cares? It's way safer. Plus, the one that I have here is super high quality, coated in three tri-ply uh, stainless steel. You will get one of those 12 inches in your, um, I almost said the name, in your cookware set. Why? Because you don't need a whole set of ceramic. You need one and you don't want clutter. I'm giving away too, inform too much information, but it's going to be the essential cookware set that every home cook needs. Is that exciting to you? Everybody's uh, excited about the pants in the pot. They are? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And a five dollars for rolls from Molly. Ah. Molly, good yeah. guy, yeah. Miss Molly. Stop, Thank stop, you. Stop, stop, stop. Very passionate about some projects coming out. Obviously, uh, yeah. the lemonade has been a huge hit. We have keto hot chocolate stop, coming. Stop, stop, we have the prepared food coming stop, stop, for Costco. Stop, stop, stop. We got the cookware set coming out. Uh, we're thinking about some other products. Stop, 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 stop. But if you go to shopflavecity.com, shopflavecity.com, this is an amazing, in my opinion. 
Keto diabetic friendly lemonade. Careful. The only knock that people are giving it is that it's expensive. Yes, it's not cheap. It's a dollar a serving. Yeah. But the yeah. ingredients are literally the, look at that. next level. <laughs> look at that. We used real grapefruit, real beet powder, real acerola. So every serving of lemonade has 100% of your daily value of vitamin C. And to sweeten it, I used the most expensive stevia possible. And I blended it with non-GMO erythritol. Why? Because when you taste this, it has the same sweetness as real lemonade or real sugar with zero cooling effect. So it's expensive, and I'm a small company, me and Erica. Daddy won't give you lemonade. We don't have the economies of scale yet, but we will. We will. It Go on tastes like real movie. lemonade. Mm -hmm. There's one net carb. There's no natural flavors. There's no artificial anything. <laughs> Go to shopflavcity.com. I have a promo on the top of the website. Shopflavcity.com. And I'm working on getting it on Thrive Market. Lemonade for Rosie. Lemonade and almond milk. That sounds like a lovely combination. CP, my husband and I have been doing clean eating for two months now. He has lost 21 pounds. Whoa. He no longer has to take cholesterol medication. Hey, hey. Thank you for your great advice. Love it. was it. a change of our lives. Love it. This is this is the kind of Boom. stuff I like to hear. Boom. That's amazing. See, it's not a diet. To stop right? your cholesterol medication, that means you have no inflammation in your body. You know, that's that's the key. Yep. Cholesterol is an indication there's inflammation in the body. But so he's not on a you. diet. It's pure lifestyle. I'm getting yeah, the garbage it's not a out, diet. right? I'm just eating the foods that I still love. You can have potato chips once in a while. You can have a keto ice cream. It's just about swapping out horrible for you ingredients yeah. with good for you ingredients. It's easy. Anyone can do it. Easy like a Sunday morning. What you eat in a week? Just go on Instagram. You're gonna see what we eat every single minute of the day. Well, that and also just go I have on a, Instagram. I have a video of what I eat at 43 years old on uh, YouTube. So search Flay City, what I eat 43 years old, it'll pop up. Okay, dressing for this. This is cold pressed virgin avocado oil. It's green and beautiful and tastes like an avocado. You miss French fries? Just make them yourself once in a while and uh, fry them in avocado oil. Or bake them in avocado It's not oil. a big deal. Just don't buy them out, out and about because they're fried in cruddy oil and that's where you get in trouble. Rose and I have a video on Facebook. Yeah. Just go on also Google, search Flav City French Fries and Ketchup, and we have a video for oven baked with ketchup. Here, squeeze some of this in. The key is to eat real whole here. foods. Yes. Yes, you can have mashed potatoes. Squeeze in here, sweetie. Just, you know, make them yourself with organic potatoes and grass-fed butter. It's delicious. Yeah. I, you're still better off having ke like keto mash with cauliflower. That's a little too many <laughs> carbs. Like, yeah, That's a little I know, too many carbs. Like, <laughs> Once in a while, it's okay, Squeeze. you know. Okay. This is the thing. That's why. That's why Good. you don't have to like. It's it's not about restricting so. yourself. That's why diets don't work. Like diets don't work because people feel like they're restricting themselves all the time. They're like. Exactly. Uh, and then then it fall right back into Strawberry, like eating their uh, the the Pouring. food they used to eat exactly. in, the, in the past in their old ways. So um, that's more, why more, diets more, don't more, work. More, more, more. They're more. just temporary. For you, Rosie. Mm. And uh, they don't work. That's why you have to change your lifestyle. Yeah. Change the ingredients you use. A keto diet will work if you are really obese or have diabetes. More, 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 more. This is that um, organic strawberry infused maple syrup from Crown Maple. Exactly, strawberries. From uh, Hudson Valley. I'm just making a nice little Yeah, Bobby, listen right to Desi. Fries done right are great. Yeah. No, no, no. Let's no, do the fries keto are fries. fries. <laughs> Let's do the keto fries instead. No, 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 no. <laughs> Fries, that's fine, but um, okay, that's enough. Can I have it? Make go on sugar. Google or in this book right here. Is there keto mash in here? I forget. No, keto mash is in the other cookbook. Flav City keto cauliflower mash. It's an amazing recipe that tastes like mashed potatoes, in my opinion, or at least do 50 50. Rose, that's enough. No more. No more, sister. Oh, okay, that's for dessert. <laughs> that's for dessert. It's just coconut vinegar with the <laughs> Wow, <laughs> that's I her new thing. You. I heard you. It's a toddler that's two years old. She's gonna jump and get try to get your attention and ask for things and scream, right? Yeah. But some some people say we have to discipline her. Ah. <laughs> I'm what on is a screen. Di what is disciplining a two-year-old? Let it like? all out. Yeah. Putting her in a timeout. I don't believe in punishment. No. It's always funny to read the comments on the Facebook videos from all the. Uh, 
stellar parents out there. Yeah. It's like, we didn't ask for that, but thank you. Okay, I'm going to cook my fish in avocado oil. Once again, another high, healthy oil. Yes, Rosa Lamalan. I need to know the uh, temperature of the pan here, Rosa. Danita M, a flying pear, $9.99. Hey, all. <laughs> That's exactly what two year olds do. They're pushing the boundaries and they just need um, some clear limits. And we, we give that to Rose. Yeah. Now, I'll admit, I'm a bit soft on Rose, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Daddy's a soft. I have a hard time telling her no, but hello, it's Rose Honey Parish. You tell that face no. It's like, come on. <laughs> a little bit of mayonnaise in there. <laughs> yeah, I tell Rose I need to take a break all the time. A little bit of water. <laughs> Rose, I need a break. But she doesn't care. She doesn't stop. She don't care. Big hair don't care. Okay, fish, once again. Arctic char. Get it at Whole Foods. We put some, uh, what do we put on? What do we put on here? We put uh, turmeric, coriander, oregano, and fennel powder, right? Let's see, Bill, I love you. Yeah, we fry. We fry a lot of things. Uh, once in a fry, uh, once in a while, we will fry potatoes. You gotta get some good well, color. We out of fry, this we fry meatballs. We fry like all sorts of things. We don't really deep fry very often. But yeah, we, we yeah, yeah we don't time. deep fry. Pan fry. Actually, you know what I'm craving? You guys want to see? I'm craving proper fried chicken. I'll probably make it gluten free, but we'll fry it in avocado oil, and I'll do my famous double dip mm. dredge. You make the seasoned flour mix. And then you take the buttermilk, which you marinate in the chicken. You take it from the buttermilk into the seasoned uh, flour, back into the buttermilk, back into the flour. You get this really gnarly, thick crust on the uh, chicken. It's lovely. Yeah. How do we say no to Rose? We just say no. But uh, in general, if you want to like uh, promote the desired behavior, you just tell them what you want from them. Not like, don't uh, climb on the table. Say like feet belong on the floor, stuff like that. So like reinforce Ooh, the um, behavior you want instead of just <coughs> saying no to certain things. What's that syrup? You know where that syrup is? The maple syrup? Yeah. Oh, behind, careful, Rose. Behind me here. Careful, Rose. Rose, don't bring down the camera, please. Who is cleaning tonight? Who do you guys think is cleaning? Me. Me, myself, and I. Brad is uh, cleaning virtually all the way from Chicago. <laughs> And, and eating nice. virtually too. <laughs> it's a nice dressing, y'all. Put that over there. You can dress this kind of salad ahead of time because it's kale. It's hearty. I cook and I clean, y'all. I'm trying to find someone to help me with like house stuff because it's becoming a little too much for me to handle. But I'm more than happy to do it. I just don't have as much time anymore. I used to have a lot more time back in the day, not anymore. Yeah, air fryer. Sometimes we break out the air fryer, like to make. Um... Careful, careful, Rose. Oh, you okay, Rose? She bummed her head on there. Careful, please. It's very narrow there. My biggest issue with the air fryer is that it's small, and they're almost always coated with Teflon, which careful, I don't like. Uh, yeah, we do. Uh, mm, when yummy. Erica comes over, we do the. Um, egg rolls. Egg rolls. Right, and go on. Egg rolls, yeah. Yummy. Yeah. Yummy. Look at this from yourself. Look at that. That is scrumptious, you guys. Could add some nuts in there if you want. Could add some uh, raisins. Mmm. Gee. Wow. The combination of the strawberry infused maple syrup, the coconut vinegar. Sweet and sour, yin and yang, bada binga, shminga, hang. That's good. All right, guys. People, leave in comments down below. Let us know where you're watching from. We're hanging out in South Florida. Let's give once again a little bit of love to ThriveMarket.com. These coconut oil sweet potato chips are the bomb. But what I did is in the description box, I copy and pasted all of my favorite Thrive Market items from food to pantry to whatnot. So click the link. In the first line of the description box, thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live. No, Rosie. Here, here's your lemonade. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live. 25% off your first order. 
a free gift up to 40, there you go, $40, and it's 30 days risk free. So if you don't love Thrive Market the way I do, big deal, cancel, get your membership feedback. It's like the same thing as Amazon, you gotta pay a membership. At least score the deal, right? All my favorites are down below in the description box, but these. This is adding more lemon. Oh, to this. Well, two more. Uh, one more. She uh, edit one already. Just say no. Yeah, I said no more. No more. It so no more. Karma yeah. Three is saying my sister has lipedema. Do you have any tips to help with that? No That's more. like a fat in the legs. Mm, I don't. I have to look into that one. Rose, no more, please. Yeah. Again, uh, look into the diet. Is there inflammatory foods in the diet? Get rid of all inflammatory foods. Get rid of all the cruddy oils. Get rid of all the grains uh, and processed foods and see what happens. I guarantee you things are going to improve. I guarantee also. Keto lemonade for the wing, y'all. Uh, Loon5, I think you guys are doing a fantastic job with Rose and Bobby. I get it. Uh, have a daughter also date his little girl. Oh. Uh huh, yeah. see? Beautiful crust on the The thing is, it doesn't it. matter. Even Beautiful. if 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 Rose was a boy, Bobby would still be like a softy. Oh my God, totally! You kidding me? Yeah, he's a, he's like yeah. I'm Mr. Softy when it comes to my family. I can't say no to anyone. Right, this morning, a Sunday morning, Nessie's like, "Oh, can you make me a chicken liver mousse?" Which is a decent amount of work. And she's like, "Oh, is it too much work?" I'm like, "No, of course I'll do it for you." All right. He's the Bobby's the best. Mm. Easy foods that are easy on your kidneys. Well, I'll tell you what's not easy on your kidneys. That's coffee. Coffee is the worst for your kidneys, so avoid that. Also, mm, like a lot of red meat, also heavy for the kidney. I have a video about uh, fatty liver disease. I'm talking about kidneys, not liver. Okay. <laughs> kidney let's, liver. let's do a video about kidney. Why not? Kidney liver is just so close. Rose, careful, mom. Careful, sweetie. Lemonade. 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 Rose, no more lemonade. Come on, it's enough. No more. Put one scoop in here. We're wasting our lemonade. Here, one scoop. Good. No more. No. Just one. No more. <laughs> Lots of questions about Johnny P. Bobby's dad. He's doing great, you guys. Thanks for asking. I'm getting much better. Got him some full-time help now because he fell. Did some rehab, but he's much better. So nice of you to ask. Yeah, Montessori is the best uh, way to raise children. That's why we do Montessori at home with Rose. All right. Fish is done. Look at that. Beautiful. That's the first one. Fishy. Who wants fishy? Do you want some fish, Rose? Hello from Mexico. Hi, guys. Mexico and la casa. Yeah, baby. What is the best kid cereal? The best kid cereal, in my opinion, I've talked about it a million times, is this. It's the Thrive Market <coughs> Coconut Flakes. First of all, it tastes like crispy coconut because the ingredients are insane. It's coconut meat, coconut water, and a touch of starch. It's not palm oil, it's palm starch. It's nine grams of net carbs. It tastes like crispy coconut meat. It's amazing. At the store, the best kids cereal would be um, Seven Sunday. Seven Sundays. They make a paleo um, cereal sweetened with uh, maple sugar or co coconut sugar. Uh, Seven Sundays. That's really about it. Oh, Love Bird. Love Bird is really good too. Mm. Best food for your pancreas. Like. I, oh, I the, I don't thing, know. the funny thing is like people always ask what's the best food for this but then even if you eat that best food are you still eating all the bad food that is causing the issues there so 
I would focus on what to avoid more than yeah. what to eat. Because even if you yeah. add to your diet, but still keep eating all the crap out there, you're still gonna have issues. The pancreas, you know, produces an enzyme. So if it, if you're suffering from from some enzyme issues, then you probably have been abusing your body, eating bad foods, and killing those enzymes. So you gotta stop and switch to a clean diet. And that's the key. Yeah. And enzymes over time tend to to disappear in yeah, the body with, with age and with really, really bad food. So take care of yourself now uh, so you don't have to suffer later. And um, just, it's a maintenance, you know, you have to maintain uh, all the time and um, stick, to, stick to a clean diet. Yeah, once again, I mean, I have to look into it, but my guess would be an anti-inflammatory diet would be the place to start there. Easy dinner, easy cleanup. My favorite. Yeah, Rose is looking at pictures. <clears throat> Are you, Rosie? She loves looking at pictures, yeah. All right, we're finishing up here. Fish is in the pan. Uh, once again, if you want to check out the keto lemonade, you can go to shopflavecity.com. But this is so cool because we used a real freeze-dried crystallized lemon non-GMO erythritol. There's acerola. Let me see if I can focus on here. There's acerola powder in there and that's the most expensive stevia you can buy. But because we used acerola, look at that. There's a hundred percent of your daily value of vitamin C in both that and the pink grapefruit. And grapefruit doesn't even have natural flavors. It has real grapefruit, real beet powder, and the same other ingredients. It's amazing stuff. You add one scoop, the eight ounces of water, it's a 30 day supply for $30. It's so darn good. Ooh, that fish. Woo, that fish is beautiful. Stacy has been, has been doing low carb keto for three months and losing about a pound a week. Ooh. Is that normal? Yeah, everyone's different. I, I think as long I as mean, you're losing. Yeah, at first in the beginning, you're gonna lose a yeah. lot, right? And depends on how much you, you wanna lose or yeah. you have to lose. Yeah. Um, also make sure your fat intake is moderate and you're eating good quality fats like the avocado mm -hmm. oils, virgin oils. And also I think combining exercise with that would be really nice. Yeah, Arctic char is the fish. Yeah, Arctic char. You can get it at Whole Foods. I really don't see it anywhere else. And it's fatty. It, it's kind of like a mix between fatty salmon and white fish. It's high quality farm raised. You can bake it in the oven or pan sear it like this and serve it with sweet potatoes, a salad, cauliflower rice. Very versatile fish. It's so yummy. The air doctor's kicking Yeah, up. what does erythritol taste like? They don't like fake sweeteners. Yeah, so erythritol in general will have a little bit of a cooling effect, but because we use very little bit and then combined it with super high quality stevia, you get no, in my opinion. What do you think? There's no cooling effect or sugar alcohol flavor in my in my lemonade what do you think uh no no that's the thing uh that's the thing sometimes people use a lot in, of that in certain products and when you eat it like if it's a cookie and you yeah. taste it has a cooling effect on your tongue i, I don't quite like that so I, personally i'm not a big fan of, of, of erythritol and it and it just gives me the runs too so uh, if you can avoid it, um, just don't don't have it. Um, I would I would do stevia instead if you want to stay like zero sugar. Well, my my stomach is very sensitive, and actually, if I have too much erythritol, I'll get a stomach ache. But because we use just a little bit, and we use really good quality, I have no stomach problems at all with mine. And more importantly, the flavor is smooth and sweet like sugar. You get zero, I'm not even joking, zero cooling effect. And the same is true. We just finalized it last night after months and months of testing. We've gone through maybe 25 iterations, but raise your hand or hit that like button if you're excited for this product coming out in the late fall, Keto Hot Chocolate. And once again, we're blending really good erythritol and stevia. It's rich, it's creamy, it has zero cooling effect. To accomplish that, please keep in mind, it's not easy and it's not cheap. 
But I'd rather do that get it. than have a crappy product it's on the that floor, has cooling get it. effects. All right, fish is uh, done. I'll put a little dab of ghee on top. What's your input on fat-free cheese to lose weight? So there's a problem with this question already. Yeah. If you want to lose weight, you don't avoid fat. It's actually you want to avoid carbs. You want to avoid sugars and carbs, which is in the form of grains, processed foods, and all I'll sorts of um, uh, sugars and stuff like that. So if you want to lose weight, eat all the uh, full fat cheese you want. Yeah. Don't eat potatoes, rice, and uh, bread. Full fat, especially dairy, is incredibly good for you. It has omega-3 fatty acids and other health properties. Fat-free, anything is terrible. Um, go on YouTube. I thought the video would do better, actually. Search Flav City Fat-Free Foods. It's called Fat-Free Foods Are Making You Fat. Because what happens, Desi, when you remove fat from something? It has zero flavor. She agrees. Uh, so you have to pump up either sugar or other fake ingredients. Fat-free food is horrible for your body, including dairy. So the Flav City app is out. You can find it well, on the App works. Store. And uh, on Google Play, just search Bobby Approved. It's there. Okay, let's show how it works. Bra Bra is in Chicago. Bra Bra is not working with, for us anymore, unfortunately. He had a family uh, issue. He had to go out to Chicago. Can you demo the uh, Flav City app? Yeah, sure. So, Flav City app. Show the homepage and it'll walk everyone through it. Hold on. My phone is about to die, you guys. Yeah. All right, so um, here is the Bobby Proof app. This is the home screen. You'd be interested in the scanning feature. You scan a product, a barcode, and then it tells you if it's Bobby approved or not. Here's the huge chocolate. They're Bobby approved. Do we have something that's not Bobby approved? Um, yeah, because the cool thing is I'll tell you why it's not approved. Um, uh, I can pull up something on the iPad, maybe. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Or the computer. Yeah, I don't have any non-Bobby approved like, products uh, here. Like, for example. Oh, just scan a barcode, you mean? Yeah, yeah. Because obviously it's nice to tell you yes or no, but I want to tell you why. So if something is not Bobby approved, it'll highlight the crappy ingredient. So you know, oh, this has sunflower oil. I didn't know it. But it will give you other alternatives below it. So Desi's going to scan something online just to give you an idea. A lot of thought, a lot of money went into it too, but it's going to be, in my opinion, unlike anything out there. Because Weight Watchers points, what does that mean? Uh, giving a nutritional score, what does that mean? I'm telling you best-in-class ingredients. Okay, here I'm going to I'm gonna scan it's a, a, free app, by the way, a random free. Prog product here online. And it's a yogurt. It's not Bobby approved because why? Look at all the highlighted ingredients See? in red. Yeah, and then if you're wondering, oh, but what kind of yogurt is Bobby approved? You got suggestions on the bottom. There you go. So that'll be like having me shopping with you at the grocery store. Tell people again where they can find it, Desi. On the App Store and Google Play, search Bobby Approved. Yeah, yeah, we've been working on this app for over a year, you guys. And, um, yeah, we spent a lot of money on it. And we're still spending Who money cares? on it. I don't it. care. Just so I know, it's uh, a lot but of it's work. Free. it's free. And app. we're giving it to you guys for free. We were going to charge for it, but then literally the last month before it came out, you know, I said I can't charge. Eventually, I'll have Bobby approved companies like Thrive Market, Kettle on Fire, advertise on the app, not random ads, like sponsored placements, like Flav City fans will get X amount of discount, but I can't charge you guys. I, I don't, I, I can't do that. Um, so yeah, search it. It's a free app. We got you covered. Da, it's free, Resi, da. Da. People are excited. Good. Lots of exciting stuff, you guys. That, the Flav City prepared meals, the lemonade, the cookware set, keto hot chocolate. Lots of exciting stuff. Dinner to me is exciting. Look at this.
building the new house in Boca. Bobby exciting. approved, or just search Flake City, you'll find it, you guys. Yeah. Or Bobby Parish, you can search for Bobby Parish, you'll find it. There's pretty much no way you can't find it. I yeah. Think. <laughs> and then also, if you like it, please give a positive review, right? Yeah, please give a positive review. Uh, We're still if working you love out it. some yeah. kinks, also. So some people are like wise asses and leave a bad review. It's like, we're not even advertising it to anyone besides you guys now. I haven't done anywhere on social media because we're doing a soft launch. And yeah, also, so if you guys see any issues like a product should be Bobby approved, but it's not or vice versa, or there's like a major issue with a product, like things like there's a wrong product name or something, email support at flakecity.com. Which support, is one of us. Support so at flakecity.com. And let us know. Um, like I said, we just, it's been, the, the app's been out for literally like two and a half, three weeks. And we're trying to uh, uh, cover as many products as possible every day and approve as many new products as possible. So your help is really appreciated. And also if uh, you're prompted to take a photo of a product, oh, yeah. a little um, kind of icon for a, for a picture, Please go, do. go ahead and do it. This is gonna help you reach the database and help everybody out. Yep. Jackie Spiegel, thank you, Bobby, for all the good that you're doing to keep your uh, Flav City family healthy and Thanks, all the Jax. buzz that you're coming out with. We love Flav City a family Free. and adore Sweet Rosie. <laughs> thank you, Jackie. You're the best. $50. Wow, Jackie, thank you. So, so thoughtful. Yeah, the thing about the app is it's not so clear cut as like, oh, this is a bad product. Words are sped, spelled differently. Sugar can be said with 50 different words. So it's very tricky. So there are still products you're gonna scan and it might come up wrong here and there. Those are growing pains, right? What is a high quality erythritol? What is a high quality one? Yeah. Well, it, it really talks about how much it's processed. Uh, the level of quality, is it like a low grade that has a really horrible flavor? Is it a high grade? I couldn't tell you necessarily one on the grocery store, but the one we chose for the Flav City Lemonade is one. But I, I don't really know too many. Too. Rosie. Okay, dinner's done, my friends. This is about as tasty Want to try some fish roast? Yeah, Coco June. Have you heard of Coco June? Co yeah, I have. It's I haven't tried it. Yeah, if you guys see it at a grocery store, just scan it and add it to our database, and it's gonna it's gonna show up here. Yeah. It just uh, it's a new product, so yeah. we probably don't have it but yet. But tell people about products that don't have ingredients and why that's so challenging for us too. Yeah. So yeah, a lot of products don't have ingredients. Uh, Meaning like in what, the when you scan it in the, the database. So that's challenging for us to approve it because we can't see it. So take a, take a photo whenever you're prompted and um, that will make our uh, work much easier. We use the USDA database, we use a third party database, but a lot of times there's like 800,000 products in the grocery store. A lot of times they come back with empty ingredients. So we have currently like 6,000 that I have to review that have no ingredients. A lot of them I can see and recognize, but other ones, no. So we're hiring people now to do data entry so yeah, it's okay, very we'll challenging, but once we get over that initial yeah. like hurdle or that data dump, we'll be in really good shape because no one's going to have a database like us. And then as people continue to scan new things, they go straight into the good. system. Like you can scan something right now, and if it pe says pending review, I could pull this up in real time and be like, boom, oh, someone just scanned up. Uh, yeah. It's approved. No, it's approved not. Yeah, literally, Bobby's been approving. Like he spends like at least two, three hours a day. A day. Approving I products like this. Look, on the There's my admin panel. See pending review. There's six thousand here. I go through like this. Oh, this is uh, hand-picked crab meat. There's no uh, bull crap ingredients. Okay, that's approved. So a lot of stuff I know from visual, so I can just be like, boom, boom, boom. But we currently have 6,000 don't have any ingredients. So a lot of those were hiring people to enter data. Um, but we're gonna have a really cool thing. So that's it. Uh, Desi, try one little bite here. Let's try some fish. A little pescado for mama. Mama. I love it. Nice spice rub. Try that salad, it's actually bomb. Mmm. Isn't that nice? Mm-hmm. Fresh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Really fresh. Absolutely delicious. So guys, that is it. 
that's the kind of food you want to eat in the summertime. Um, thank you for hanging out once again no, no, in the no, description no, box. No, 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 no. You have to click the air on mobile. We love Thrive Market. Show them some support. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live. No, 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 no. Click that link. Get 25% off your first order, a free gift up to $40, and it's 30 days risk free. So if you don't love it, cancel. Get your membership fee back, but all my favorite Thrive Market stuff is there. I talked about them. I loved them. Mm. Check them out, you guys. All right, we'll see you next week. Have a great night. Bye, Jackie. Bye, everyone.